You useless piece of junk. I kidnapped the future Mega Man and this is the performance he gives me. Bah! I'll have to finish Mega Man myself. As for you, Quint. It doesn't matter. I'll decide what to do with you after I destroy Mega Man. Away with you! Two hours later. Wily abandoned me? His command protocols. They're gone. He has forgotten what I am. I am Mega Man. I feel my power coming back to me. Shatner. Wily, I won't wait for my past to stop you. I'll do it myself. Fuck yeah, Quint Revenge! Yes, another new Gomer Play series. How you doing, everybody? This is awesome! Ah, uh, this was done by uh, the guys over at Sprites Incorporated. I think uh, Ace Spark is the one who is behind the whole thing. And, well, let's get right into it. I've got it set up for the gamepad, but if you want to set up the controls, you do that there. There's some other options. Uh, I think you can, like, yeah, you can, like, ship shift your screen size, all that good stuff. I'm keeping my lives to infinite because I don't want to deal with having to redo stages over again because god damn it that gets annoying. And it could be annoying for you guys too. So I'm just gonna start up a new game. Where am I? It's time I bust out of here. Yay, an intro stage! Blast that Dr. Wily forcing me to fight a past version of myself. You know, paradoxes. Time to ask the, test the air jump. I should be able to jump off uh, after... Yeah, you read it. Yeah, whoop, yep, the air jump. One of those things that's unique to this game. And here's something else. Duck, you can crouch. A Mega Man game in which you can crouch? Holy shit. And of course it tells you how to beat a fucking hammer Joe. So let's go this way, or this way. My magnetic gloves should keep me attached to ladders even if something hits me. And it does the concept. <laughs> so hey, it's a Sakugarn symbol. It makes you invincible to things like spikes and destroys certain enemies. Use the dash bun button. Whee! Ah, you can't get me. Near, 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 near. That probably one hit kill me. And dash, you can hold on to it as long as you want, and you'll still keep dashing. Okay. By jumping using the by using the dash mid jump, I should clear this obstacle. Whee! There you go. Get some life, and away we go. Hi. And this guy's relatively easy. You just shoot his hands until he's dead. And the hands even give you energy. <laughs> It's actually creatively put together a boss there. That's pretty cool. And of course you can save. Whoop! I forgot to actually save the game, but that's okay. Um, we'll make sure I do it, you know, the next at, at the next point. Now, since there was only an intro stage, we get to pick one other stage, because that's how I do with Mega Man games like this. So let's go with you know. I can't defeat a man, except I totally can because I'm not such a sucky player. <laughs> nah, that's actually a great song, and I understand people's frustration with them, but... Woo! Now, this... Now, this particular game, I seem to remember, um... Oh, God. Yeah, elo I, I am very eloquent while I'm playing platformer games, aren't I? Um... But, um... I, I want to say that part of this was inspired, I don't know if it was inspired, but they actually used the uh, remixes that a guy by the name of RushJet1 had posted up on, I think, Bandcamp? And eventually YouTube, and he does some really great remixes, and that's what they originally used. In fact, when uh, RushJet1 actually did a playthrough of this, he, he used the one that used his tracks, and he was like, oh, hey, cool, you know? 
And, and, and of course now we have the... Whoa, hi! And now we have the tracks that we have now. Which, by the way, if, if you want to check out that particular music from Rush Jet 1, go to Bandcamp, look up Rush Jet... I think it's Bandcamp. Look up Rush Jet 1, and you can actually get these albums for free. Ow! I forget about that. Okay, where are we? We're, okay, we're just back there? Good. Fuck those things. I hate these things. Up and down type enemies. I hate them, 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 I wish they would die. Clouds! More clouds! What's this way? Oh yeah, Sakugarn. I did not know this was here before. Oh wow, that's pretty cool. Oh pff, that works. Okay. Yeah, naturally I've, I've, I've played the game at least once through before starting this series. Hey, look at this! Yay! <laughs> Whoop! Oh, that was close. Whoop, and here we are! Stages are rather short, but they're fine. Uh, boss battles, depending on the boss battle, they can be really tough. But this guy should not be a problem. Hi! And hey, I could just crouch under that one. Hey, you never had a Mega Man who could crouch before, Air Man. There you go. And away we go. That was easy. You get the Air Shooter. Yay. All right, so remember, fire to save, start to exit. Got to remember that. So yeah, there we go. <laughs> One down, seven more to go out of these Robot Masters. Good start so far, good start. Kind of short and sweet and just the way I like it sometimes. Oh, so yes, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying it. If you like this, you can do the usual like, subscribe, leave a comment. Constructive criticism is always welcome. And if you want to help in a more monetary fashion, help me get more games, upgrade equipment, that sort of thing, head over to patreon.com slash gomer21xx for as little as $1 per production. You get things like these videos at least a day early. By the way, I do upload these in batches, so you tend to get more than one early. Except for podcasts. Those tend to come one at a time. But that's okay. That happens sometimes. Ooh, and I don't think she's doing the title card... Uh, art for this particular series I actually at the time I'm recording this I haven't put the title card artwork together yet but um, whether she does or not go check out Becky Hopkins not only is she an amazing artist an award winning animator she's also my girlfriend and she has a website becky-hopkins.com check that out commission her over at patreon.com slash Becky Hop and don't be and be sure to check out her webcomic Otherworldly all those links are down in the doobly doo Otherworldly the only webcomic in which in which that I've read that has a, a chandelier flail. Chandelier flail. How awesome is that? Go check it out. And until next time, this is Gomer the Ranting Thespian signing off. <laughs>